Hi, Todd Bates from Haunted Voices Radio. I've been getting a lot of feedback about the new chat room and how you guys can get in there and really interact. Uh, we, we'd like to see a lot more people in chat during the live program. That way you guys can be a part of the show and uh, the archive afterwards. Uh, your input's very important. We get some amazing guests on here. We love your feedback, questions, comments, things like that. So let me show you some of the features here of the chat room. It's actually real simple. Um, at the beginning, you can see Ariel and I are in there. You're going to get prompted to log in through Facebook, Twitter um, as a guest. And now there's a new registration form in there as well, where you can actually register for uh, the chat room. You just put your name and email. Don't worry. We don't sell it. We're not creepy like that. But that way you guys can log in and uh, it usually logs you in automatically after that. So what you see here with the chat room, of course, this is the chat body. And you would type your message down here below where it says type message. You would just type in test and you're going to see it pop up there. Now, what you see here at the end, you'll, you're going to see the Twitter and Facebook. Now, you can share this with your friends. If, if there's a good topic coming on, you think some of your friends are going to be interested in that, just share that and it'll go to your Facebook or Twitter wall. Now, also over here, there is an inf uh, invite friends option where you can invite your friends from Facebook or Twitter to come into chat. Now, you're not able to hear the program while you're in chat. That's why we recommend uh, using a PC or, or Mac, and you can log into chat and then listen through one of the third-party players that are on the main page of hauntedvoices.com. Uh, for example, Media Player, Winamp, iTunes. And that way, that's playing in the background, and you're still going to be able to chat. Now, that it's also, that is also the trick you can use on your mobile phone or tablet if you log in through, let's say, the Shoutcast uh, um, image there on hauntedvoices.com or Media Player or Winamp, uh, Real Player. You'll be able to listen to the show and chat at the same time on your smartphone or mobile device. That is a trick that uh, a lot of you guys have been asking. But some of the features here you have with the chat, it's pretty amazing. Uh, you've got your little smiley faces here you can use down here in the bottom. And what this paperclip does, it allows you to upload images. Uh, it also allows you to upload certain files. And if you, let's say, go to YouTube and you find something you think is relevant to the program, the discussion we're talking about, you can actually copy that link and paste it, and it will show the video right there in the chat room. And... I, I won't be able to hear it during the broadcast, but the listeners will be able to see it and hear it and click play. Just make them relevant to the program. I don't post uh, some kind of new coupon going on at McDonald's or anything. Just make it relevant to the show. Now, some of the things you guys can do with each other is, uh, let me get uh, Ariel log back in here. Because what you can do is a lot of cool features. There's you guys can have audio um, discussions between each other, between chatters. We've added that service. You can also do video chat. It's all free of charge in there if you guys wanted to talk privately. So many different things you can do in this chat room. And, and we, we do thank Rumble Talk for uh, adding a lot of these features here for us free of charge. We, we've had them for several years, and uh, E. Isle is the, is the owner there, and he's a, he's a fantastic guy. So we're trying to, their new beta test. So there's a lot more uh, different things that you can use uh, on the chat, and we're going get, to uh, get straight to those here in just one moment once I get her logged in because it does kind of time you out every once in a while. Some people are in there, and they do forget. Uh, that they're in there. So let me get uh, her logged in. If I get the right password, us Rumble Talk people have to log in that way. Okay, so now you see Ariel. Let's say I wanted to send Ariel a private message. I would just double click the name and a private message shows up. You type your message right here, and the guest or host will get that. Now, there's several things that you can do. Uh, I've got some of the audio features turned off at the moment. We're still testing those, but in the future, you're gonna be able to actually call one of the other chatters, talk to them audio, or you can do video chats with them, and it's not gonna interfere with the program at all. 
Now, some of the buttons down here at the bottom, these are some things that you guys had some questions about. Uh, this thumbtack, for example, let's say the chat's getting pretty heavy and we do get some pretty hectic conversations in there. You just click that thumbtack, push it down, and it stops the scroll until you're ready to continue. Uh, the other feature, you can actually export it if you want as an HTML file, if you want to change, uh, keep the transcript. Now, this is one of my favorites. What this does, it pops it out in a separate window. That way you're not stuck to the browser. So you see how it pops it out. Now it's in its own window, and none of the other tabs that you have are going to be interfering with that. Now, this is the, the sound. Uh, if you see the volume horn larger, then that means you're going to get a sound. It's going to be a beep. But you can turn that off to mute it. And again, that's not going to affect the programming if that's going on there, because we do have that disconnected from it. Now, this is for us. Uh, it's to clear all chat messages. But one cool feature about this, you're going to see this setting as well. And what it's going to do, it's going to pop up this barcode. Now, if you have a smartphone with a QR reader, let's say you're on the computer and you want to switch to your tablet or your smartphone, you just open up your QR reader, you scan that, and it pulls the chat and everything going right there to your smartphone like nothing ever got uh, left off. You can pick up right where you left off. And we always ask you to log out of chat when you're finished. So you just simply click this power button, you log out, and that's it. So if you have any other questions about the chat room, just get in there and chat, keep it clean, have fun, ask some questions, post those questions in all capital letters. That's what makes the show fun, your interaction. That's why we're here. So we need your listener feedback on uh, what you'd like the guests to talk about, uh, your opinions on what they're saying. It's a very safe environment to post those. We don't judge anyone here. And it's just a great forum to meet new people, new like-minded people, share some ideas. So that is how you work the chat room. Again, you can log in through Facebook, Twitter, this Rumble Talk is for staff, or you can register. You just click that, you fill in your username, password, email, and the image URL, URL you want on there, and a description of yourself, and you just click register, and all that's going to be right there. So that is the WGOGDB official chat room. That'll be airing through all programs, hauntedvoices.com and a gangofgirls.com do use the same chat room. So enjoy it. That's what it's all about.